Four seconds separating shot clock and game clock. Westbrook looking for James. He's got it. Coming to the end of the third quarter. LeBron James, a shot in history. And there it is! LeBron stands alone! The NBA's all-time scoring record now belongs to LeBron James. When it comes down to the GOAT conversation, and no disrespect to MJ, because I got Jays on my feet right now. But come on now, this conversation is dead. It's LeBron James. LeBron started in 03. By 2005, LeBron was the best player in the NBA. Yeah. In 2020, he was still the best player in the NBA. He was the best player in the NBA no matter what the game did. And he's been the best no matter what. When you look at the teams that LeBron has carried to championship, or carry to the finals. MJ didn't beat the greatest team ever assembled, nor did he run up against the greatest team ever assembled every year. You look at the skill set that Bron has, there's nobody that has ever played the game of basketball that can do what LeBron James does on basketball court. Nobody. Why y'all still hating, man? You gotta just sit back and just appreciate greatness while it's here, man. This is the GOAT, all right? This is the second coming. You feel me, though? This is the chosen one, man. I'm just now making you the greatest player of all time. Are you now the GOAT? <laughs> Uh, you know, I'm gonna let everybody else, uh, you know, decide who that is or just talk about it. But it's great. It's great barbershop uh, talk. You know, oh, for no, me, I, I want to hear you say Listen, it, big fella. Brown. Listen, big fella. I, I, I want to hear you say it, Bron. Me personally, I'm, I, me personally, say it with you know, your I'm, chest, always, I'm gonna take Brown. myself. I'm gonna take myself <laughs> against anybody that's ever played this game. Um, you know, but everyone's gonna have their favorite. Everyone's gonna, you know, decide who they who, who their favorite is. But um, I know what I've brought to the table. I know what I bring to the table every single night, and, and what I can what I can do out on this floor. So, um, you know, I always feel like I'm the best to ever play this game, but, you know, there's so many other great ones, and I'm happy to just be a part of their, uh, part of their journey. <laughs> it's a crazy game last night. Yeah, LeBron is something else. Yeah, greatest of all time. I mean, sure. After John Brown. One of the greatest players to have ever played the game. No doubt about it. He has exceeded expectation, and I have nothing but respect, profound respect for the greatness of LeBron James. But I have told you before, he never was, he never has been, nor will he ever be greater than John Brown. It will not happen. Um, it's not even a debate for me. I haven't even, I, listen, the only reason I discuss it is because people occasionally ask, and I always get annoyed at the question because I'm appalled that anybody would think I'm going to change my mind based on what I saw. There's nothing to discuss here. Stephen A. Smith, what you just said is 101% correctly. LeBron James is going to go down in history as one of the greatest basketball players to ever touch the court. And he is top three, if you ask me. But when it comes to the number one slot, he is not there, because that slot belongs to John Buckets Brown. Also, I would admit, John Brown does not have that much achievements compared to LeBron James. But I am gonna tell you something that LeBron James wasn't able to accomplish nor other people could say they've done before and that is beat Michael Jordan in a 1v1 OW! Greatest has just been shown and that man is John Brown! And that's why this 1v1 is special because we are gonna get two icons of the NBA and we are gonna put them together against each other 
to finally see Who's the go? <laughs> the 1v1 is about to begin. Sit back and relax and see who truly is the GOAT of the NBA. LeBron James has now tied the score, 3-3. Three, three. John Brown seems a little more careful and smart about his shot selection, but at the same time, I feel like he's not going for enough risks. But the main factor why John Brown is not going for risks is because LeBron's defense is on point right now. John Brown can't stop LeBron James going into the post. There's no pressure. There's no pressure at all. I've been getting pressure since I was 10 years old. I don't think there's no pressure for me because I'm doing something that I love to do. That's play the game of basketball. We are seeing a end to an era. The John Brown era is coming to an end. But it looks like John Brown has something up his sleeves and he's finally gonna go for that risk. Do it John Brown. Do it for your legacy. Let the people know who truly is the GOAT. And that man is... John Brown! <laughs> John Brown goes to the paint and he gets that easy dunk! For it's 18. Three-pointer, is it in? Yes, indeed it is! Over LeBron James. LeBron is putting John Brown in that post. Could John Brown stop him? No, he can't. LeBron James is just bigger and stronger. Another three! Could he make it? No! But at least it's good to know that. John Brown is going for risky shots. One more point away for LeBron James getting the win and being the GOAT.
No matter what John Brown wants to do, LeBron James still has the upper hand and like that, the game is over! The kid from Akron, Ohio, the chosen one, the king himself, LeBron James gets the W! We finally see who truly is the GO! <laughs>